Hey guys, welcome to another video from Coast for You. In this tutorial, we will be learning how to read in and write out decimal numbers in Pepe assembly language. So, uh, first things first, we're going to want to create a variable or space in memory um, where we can store the number or numbers. Um, so we can call number, um, and uh, we're going to want to reserve one byte. So that's block one byte. And that's all we have to do to instantiate the variable, for example. Um, and then we're going to want to create our equivalent of a Java main method or C main method, whatever you program in. Um, so we're going to say main. And we're going to say deci. So that's decimal input. Um, and we want to store it into number. And it's in memory. So there we have that. Um, so that's reading in the number. Now, I like to um, match everything up because it just looks nice in my opinion, but PEP8 doesn't need um, proper indentation like Java does or other languages like Python. So now we can say deco, which is decimal output. We can say number. And again, this is D. Um, so from memory. Uh, rather than immediate, um, and then we can say stop to stop the program and end. Um, and what we want to do again is put up the top br to make it branch off to main at the beginning so it doesn't screw everything up. And if we just run source, you can see terminal io has um, a little underscore in it um, wanting you to input something, so 10, and it outputs 10 afterwards. So um, that's as easy as that. Um, if there's anything else you want, uh, as in tutorial-wise, uh, let me know in the comments down below, and I'll try and get those videos made. Thanks.